Hey guys, it's Sydney. Today I'm going to be doing my dorm haul for college since it's my first move-in day soon. So that's coming up real quick. I'm just going to show you all the stuff I got for my dorm and maybe a couple of articles of clothing, but I'm not really going to go too in-depth with the clothing quite yet. And then I'm probably going to make another video of my move-in day. But yeah, this video is just going to be quick. Just going to show you what I got, where I got it from, about how much it cost, and yeah. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy the video. Thanks for watching. So, first thing I'm going to be showing you is some of my kitchen stuff. Um, I got these cups from Target. They're all like 50 cents each because my dorm is like an apartment kind of suite style. So there's four bedrooms, two bathrooms, a kitchen slash living room with no stove, but it's still kind of like a kitchen with a fridge and like a microwave. And so that's going to be that kind of style of a dorm. So obviously I need to get some like stuff for my kitchen. So here's some cups. I got them in blues, like different hues of blues. I also got some bowls. These are, again, still like 50 cents each, you know, you couldn't go around with no bowl. I also got this can opener from Target. I don't remember how much it cost, but it was like probably $2. I also got these kitchen scissors from Target, so that's nice. Tons, I got tons of plates, as you can see, you know. Probably gonna wash these before I bring them to school, so. I also got some tubbleware from the Dollar General. You never know when you're gonna need those. Paper towel holder, also from Dollar General, as you can see. Also from Target, I got like this drawer, kitchen drawer sorter. And the final thing, if you can see it, it is an air fryer. So this is the air fryer I got, super convenient, super nice. I think it was $50 from Amazon, I could be wrong though. So that's my kitchen stuff. And last but not least, in terms of kitchen stuff, I got this Keurig. I mean, I'm not a heavy coffee drinker, but it's nice to have. Like, I'll drink coffee like maybe two, three times a week, and it just saves a lot of money because you can just buy the brew yourself and then just make it. You fill it up with water here, and then you put the like Keurig um, reusable container in there, and then yeah, I'll just keep it moving, and it makes like a good batch of coffee. So that's my mini Keurig. So that's pretty much my kitchen stuff. I'm going to show you some other stuff that I got. Probably leaning towards like the bathroom and my cleaning supplies and stuff. And then just a couple of dorm decorations. So I know I said bathroom, but like I had to get a bunch of granola bars because that's all I like to eat on the go. And I like snacks and I like granola bars. So I got granola bars. So that, that can go with my kitchen stuff. Lysol for the bathroom dish soap, toilet cleaner for the toilet, a sponge holder probably from Dollar Tree, hair catcher from Pop Shelf for about $2 just to make sure that my drains stay clean longer. got this clothes hamper for about $5 at Pop Shelf. I don't really like hampers with wheels, but that's just me, so. A bathroom caddy, you know I don't have a communal bathroom, I just wanted one to just make sure I could transport like whenever I'm traveling for track or anything like that just to have. Shower curtain. Me and my roommate didn't really decide on the color, so I just kind of picked a neutral one, like gray. So that's just a shower curtain. A $5 drying mat from Target. I didn't really know what I wanted for curtains in my room, so I just got a white sheer curtain just to match everything and not be complete blackout shades. A $10 bath mat. Um, it's a little small, but I got it from Target, and it's just gray to go with my bathroom's theme. You always need hand towels. Got these from Marshalls for about 10 bucks. A two-piece kitchen towel set from Pop Shelf for $5. I love white Nike socks. Them, I got these from Sports Academy for about 20 bucks. You need microfiber cleaning towels. So I got these from Marshalls for $7. You're gonna need emergency. Um, this is just a small pack, but just to keep my immune system boosted, especially since there's gonna be so many people I'm gonna be around. So that's just one thing to keep in mind. I know dorms don't typically allow candles, but I got this like wall scent that was about $12. And then the scent itself was $7.50. So that's just to keep my room smelling kind of decent. Cause you know, it's kind of musty in dorms. So that's just one thing I want to do. Just not have a musty dorm. I got a lamp, a bedside lamp. It was about $10 from Target. Target has such a great dorm collection, by the way. So again, keeping with the theme of gray for my bathroom, I got this um, toothbrush sorter, so just to keep um, me and my roommates' toothbrushes together. And then I also got soap dispensers. I got two of these. 
just for like the kitchen and the bathroom just to keep you know obviously your hands clean and then I also got this trash can for about five bucks from Target um, just like a little small trash can to keep in the bathroom also another trash can probably gonna keep in my room or the kitchen it's just good to have trash cans also I got this clothes basket for five dollars at pop shop they had a bunch of different sizes but I just wanted one that was kind of easy to carry and just was like didn't take up too much space so here's one last couple things for the bathroom i got a makeup mirror or just like a small face mirror just to have to make sure i have in my bathroom just kept a white one because it's neutral got that from target for about five bucks a bathroom mat for my shower just so i don't slip in the shower also about five bucks from target a shower liner i got this from pop shelf i believe so this is also about five dollars just to you know have that separation between my um, shower curtain and the bath. You don't want to get it wet because it's fabric. So here's the shower liner. So a couple of like personal items. I got a new toothbrush from Pop Shelf for a dollar. Um, some band-aids from Pop Shelf for about two dollars. You know, probably should get a first aid kit, but it's just to start me off. Um, a bunch of toothpaste from Costco. Then I also got some OGX body wash, just three different flavors, scent, smells, whatever, from Costco. So I got the rose water and pink salt coconut miracle oil and coconut coffee and then some therabreath mouthwash for about fifteen dollars from Publix. Next thing I got here is some storage just to have in my room. Um, so we just got these from Pop Shelf for five dollars each, you know, just to have as some sorter slash organizers for my room just to make sure stuff stays organized. Then I got some hangers from Target for five bucks. Um, it's like a pack of six. And then I also got some hangers from uh, Dollar General. Got some Shea Moisture Shampoo and Conditioner from Target for about $20 each. Just a big one to stock up on from Costco. So yeah, I don't really care what I put in my hair to be honest with the shampoo and conditioner. So I just got this random one. And uh, Shea Moisture, so yeah. Also, I got an LED light from Pop Show for probably $10. And then I also got this $2 loofah and some sponges to start me off with, about $2 each. I got two packs of these. And can't forget the shower hooks. I got these from Pop Shelf for five bucks. And I also got two of these lint rollers to start me off with. Also, I got this blanket, this throw blanket from Hobby Lobby for about $5. It was on sale. It was originally like $28. So I got this nice little throw blanket. I'll insert what my bed sheets look like. It's like a sage green color. It's kind of just hard to show all on one camera. But you'll probably see it in my moving day vlog. But yeah, so this is what my um, comforter looks like. And I got two sets of white sheets from uh, Marshalls for like $20, I believe. And so I got this blanket and my comforter. Just a sage green kind of vibe that I'm going for. Also, got a huge set of batteries from Costco for about $20. It's just double A. You never know when you're going to need batteries, so it's just convenient to have tons of them. Now, all that's left is cleaning supplies from Costco. So I got some detergent, Tide. I got some laundry sheets, um, dryer sheets from Costco as well. Bounce. Came with two packs. Um, I also got two different packs of Lysol just to make sure I can clean stuff super easily. So that's pretty much it in terms of cleaning supplies. My roommate is bringing the bulk of our cleaning supplies since we're sharing a bathroom. And I just brought a couple just to have extra. Now here's some personal stuff that I got. So I went to Ulta and I got some face stuff. So this is niacinamide, 10% uh, zinc. It was about 6.50. I just put that on my face. It's kind of like a nice like daily moisturizer and like helps you know, just keep your face clear and um, taken care of. I'm not a skincare guru, so don't, you know, don't quote me on none of this. And then I also got some salicylic acid because it's supposed to help with acne. So I put those both in the morning and the evening, um, you know, just twice a day. And then I got some, I don't know if how to pronounce this, La Roche Jose. Um, it's a purifying uh, face cleanser, it was about $10. I just use that to wash my face as well as like makeup wipes because I have a really oily face. And I'm also trying some new soap that's supposed to help with like um, dark spots on your face and your body. So this is some turmeric soap I got from Target for five bucks. 
I also got some more concealer just to start me off. It, yeah, it's LA girl, so that's some makeup. I'm not a makeup guru, as you can tell, like, my mm, face is looking a little oily. So that's all from Ulta and like the one that I borrowed so from Target. And then last couple items, um, I got this from Pop Shelf. Uh, this is $4. This is just a bunch of assorted makeup brushes. Super duper convenient. You should try it out, especially if you don't care too much about the quality of your makeup brushes, because I don't. Got some Vaseline from CVS for $2. Some primer from Target for 10 bucks. A dollar eyelash curler from Pop Shelf. A dollar blending sponge from Pop Shelf. Some bronzer from my beauty supply store for about five bucks. Also a lip liner for about two dollars from my beauty supply store. And you know, we're really on a budget, so I got some acrylic nails. So you see me? They may be press on. Never know. Just saying. Then I also got my conditioner. It's just called Curls. It's the Blueberry Bliss Leave-In Conditioner. I just used that on my hair. I got this brush for about two dollars from my local beauty supply store. Just you know. For ponytails and whatnot. Some hair ties from my local beauty supply store. I really like these kinds of hair ties because so they, they don't really break. And it was about two dollars. That was nice. Also forgot to mention uh, all of these big pillows that I got from Target were about like they're about five dollars. Um, so I got four different pillows to get from. So that's pretty much all that I got from my dorm. I mean, obviously I got tons of clothes from like Fashion Nova, PacSun, uh, H&M. New Balance, uh, thrifted some clothes, so I got tons of different clothes. Um, I might do like a back to school haul, I'm not really sure, but definitely gonna have you guys come along with me on my moving day vlog. So this is pretty much all the stuff. And I brought some posters that I'm gonna also have for my um, room decor, cause I was kinda just going for like a minimalist room, like not so much, cause I just personally don't feel like decorating my dorm. But, um, so thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. You know, if you want me to just show you a list, I'm going to be adding a list of all the stuff that I got in the description. So I really do appreciate you guys for watching through to the end. And, um, yeah. And everybody going back to school, I wish y'all a good school year. Um, you know, get all A's and B's and no C's. And so, thank you guys again for watching. I'll see you next time.